I think this is a, a huge challenge for all of us. And uh, I want to congratulate you, especially the younger people here in the room. You are the first generation which will have to deal with um, the challenge to guarantee the survival of uh, the human species. And uh, let me say this, um, we underestimated altogether, I include myself, um, we underestimated this challenge. We thought there is plenty of time. There isn't. So, you know, ultimately climate change is now the priority. But therefore, if you're making that the priority, there's going to have to be some trade-offs, economic, social, political. How do we manage to find the right trade-off? Well, I think such a big change, it's easy said, we have to decarbonize. But what does that mean? This means to create a complete new energy system, even more to create a complete new industrial society. We need a spirit of cooperation which isn't there. At the moment, there is rivalry mm -hmm. of the great powers. I'm still an optimist. It's a very complicated political game to balance uh, this trade-off. The divergence that you see in the states at the moment, again, how would you address it? How would you try and solve it? We have this discussion in Switzerland, one of the wealthiest uh, nations um, in the world. And Switzerland is uh, part of Europe. And Europe is still uh, one of the wealthiest uh, continents in the world. We have to understand that it's not only a, a, a challenge for uh, science. or it, We have a distribution problem. We have to help the Global South to join this effort. Because once the climate is out of control, uh, border doesn't matter. The climate is a global uh, challenge. Who do you think ultimately should be paying for the damage that we're doing to the environment? You know, should there be some sort of carbon tax? I think uh, a carbon tax, a global carbon tax, it will be extremely complicated uh, to, uh, to push that through because the US will say no and some others, important players, will do the same. Um, but I think in Europe it would be a, a huge achievement, a huge opportunity if we could uh, uh, decide about implementing a carbon tax. At the moment it's complicated, but uh, I'm, I think it can be done. It's, um, when you increase uh, the carbon tax, you have to reduce uh, the taxes on, uh, on a different side. Um, it must be done, because uh, it's also in our economic interest. Uh, but uh, I think the, the biggest risk is, if we don't act, if we don't act forcefully now. Joska Fischer, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> to watch the full interview with Joska Fischer, follow the link below.